Hey guys, what's up? This is G-Man, and I thought I'd just take a little bit of time out from playing the Battlefield 3 beta to do a little benchmarking on my system. Um, it, obviously it's not going to be really scientific, I'm just going to film myself playing it and see what kind of FPS I get. Um, I just thought I'd show you this. These, these are the settings that I'm going to use. I'm going to use the Ultra preset, and the resolution was set at 1920 by 1080 but that's just for this little clip here so that I can get the aspect ratio right. The actual testing will be done at 1920 by 1200 um, and I've turned V-Sync off so that we can get an accurate representation of the kind of FPS we're getting. I'm going to try it first with one GTX 460 and then two in SLI. So uh, yeah, let's get on with this. Okay, single 460. Right saying through. Yeah, not true. Come on, guys. Seriously? What the hell? 100% health, what the fuck? Still running pretty smoothly.
fuck? <laughs> oh, right. Okay, so he was under the floor. Nice. <clears throat> okay, so this is this is indoors. Let's see what kind of FPS difference we get in here. I know that key just got nailed. Ready? <laughs> right, okay. Okay, well I think you get an idea of uh, what this can do. <clears throat> okay, so what have we learnt? Um, the, the single 460 was running at around 45 to 50 FPS um, on the outdoor section of the map, which I believe is one of the more, the more strenuous parts. Um, so yeah, that was pretty impressive for a single card. I didn't think it'd do that well. Uh, but then when we went SLI, we were kind of running 60 to about 80 outdoors, um, which was nice. And then when we went indoors into the metro, we we're hitting sort of 90 plus, uh, which I was pretty impressed with. Um, I should probably tell you that I'm running the NVIDIA 285.38 beta drivers. Um, they came out specifically for the Battlefield 3 beta, so um, I'm sure they helped out a lot. Um, and the cards I'm using are the 1 gigabyte version from Gigabyte, and they have a slight factory overclock up to 715 megahertz. Uh, and that's what I was running during these tests. Um, so it wasn't the base reference clock, so... Um, just to clear up any confusion. The overclock I normally use is around 810 megahertz on both of them, so I might do another video where I overclock them, crank them up a little bit, and see what kind of results we get from that. Um, so yeah, if you're thinking of upgrading from a 460, uh, you know you might want to do that if you want to play at ultra at 1080p plus resolutions uh, at 60 FPS. But to be honest, it was still pulling around, you know, 45 to 50. And with the motion blur and uh, all that in this game, it really kind of smooths it out. So, you know, the difference between 50 and 60 really isn't that much. So, I don't know, maybe hold on to your card. Um, but if you do want to upgrade, uh, think about going SLI, because the, <laughs> the results I got were pretty nice. Um, and, you know, 460s are pretty cheap these days. So, yeah, I hope that's helped someone out. Uh, <laughs> and uh, yeah, there'll be more Battlefield content up on my channel um, Go subscribe if you haven't already And I'll see you on the next video Thanks for watching guys